continue to see a huge demand for affordable housing in our growing Idaho. The city of Boise and Ada County are partnering to address that need. Our Jude Binkley spoke with city and county officials about what they're doing to bring more affordable housing to Boise and Jude. It is desperately needed. Absolutely, Morgan, because together the city of Boise and Ada County are partnering to put almost $10 million toward affordable housing here in the city of Trees. There's one thing everyone in the Treasure Valley can agree on. In the last few years, the city of Boise, the Treasure Valley, and the state of Idaho have all seen affordability become an increasingly important issue to residents. The need for affordable housing in our communities continues to remain high, even with rents dropping over the past several months. For people to be able to stay in their homes, to stay in the city, in the county, in the state, it's something that we really need to address collectively. That progress comes through partnership. The city of Boise and Ada County are coming together to put nearly $10 million toward a new affordable housing project. Both the city and the county believe that people who live here deserve safe, healthy, and affordable homes. And we have a shared uh, priority. A $5 million pledge from the city combined with a $4.5 million grant from Ada County will fund the project. That's money received through the federal government's emergency rental assistance program. We checked around. We had some other, a couple of projects that we looked at, and uh, we knew this project was coming up with the city of Boise. The affordable housing development will be located off Fairview east of Cole Road and is expected to have about 250 apartments. 200 of those units will be designated to families making 60% of area median income or less. We want people that are that are, we have school teachers and firemen and so forth, we want them to be able to have a place to live. And some of this money is gonna be uh, targeted to 60% area medium income. Some of it's gonna be targeted to 50% of area medium income. In order to make it possible for the fabric of our communities to remain intact and for the people who make our communities what they are to stay in our communities, we need to make sure that there are uh, housing options and homes that are available at all price points, at all budgets. And a few years ago, Boise City Council set the goal of investing in 1,200 affordable homes in the city. So, Morgan, the homes being built here, the 200 affordable mm -hmm. houses will certainly go uh, toward that goal. It's kind of disheartening to hear them say, like, teachers, firefighters, these essential people that we have in our community that are making that income and that are needing this type of housing. You know, they're getting pushed out. Mm -hmm. But I'm glad they're working to address that. All right. Finding common ground on breaking new ground. Yeah. So it's great to see that. All right, Jude. Thank you.